Hey, Tony here. Today we're doing an unboxing from Shop Factory, so stay tuned to see what I got. So today I've received my order from Shop Factory. This is an order that I placed on December 27th. Um, I can't really remember exactly what all I bought, um, but I do remember that it was quite a bit of items. I think they were mostly items that were going to be going out of stock. Um, so got quite a bit of titles here. And of course, got, got them all wrapped in the Shop Factory paper. So let's see what all I got. I really do like um, purchasing from Shop Factory and especially the items that they say are going to be going out of stock. It's really nice to be able to get those items before they actually do go out of stock. <clears throat> so let's see what we've got here. Um, most of these right here I believe were blind buys. Um, some really nice looking artwork on these. So first up, I've got um, The Vampire, and which is an older movie in black and white. The Man from Planet X, another black and white film. And I'll save this one for later. Um, the Brain That Wouldn't Die. All of these I did um, research on to make sure that these would be something that I'd want to have in the collection. So um, I did do that before I purchased them. Um, Die Monster Die with Boris Karloff. Let's see. Um, the Naked Cage. It's a women's prison movie from what I remember reading about. Um, Screaming Skull, another old black and white one. And like I said, I really do like the artwork that they do on these releases. Um, What's the Matter with Helen, which looks like it's got Debbie Reynolds and Shelley Winters in it. The, Re the Return of Count Yorga. The Four Skulls of Jonathan Drake. Now this is one that I had been eyeballing for a while. It's an older one. I've read nothing but good things about it. And got that one. Invasion of the Bee Girls. And I Buried the Living. Which looks like a zombie type movie. The Bat People. Really nice looking artwork. Um, Beware the Beast Within. Yeah, these are all the titles that were going to be going out of print. And then I did pick up a few other titles. Um, some two movie collections, the double features. This has got the Outing and the Godsend. So I've got three different double features here. Um, the Beast of Hollow Mountain and the um, Neanderthal Man. Really cool looking artwork. Here's the back. And Jim Brown in I Escape from Devil's Island in The Final Option. So those are the three double features that I picked up. And I did get a um, another one that's going out of print from Shot Select, the Handman, uh, the Handmaid's Tale. Um, I was holding off on getting this one, and when I saw that it was going out of print, I decided to go ahead and get this one. So those are the items that I got from the Shop Factory, Screen Factory, um, going out of print sale. I don't really know that it was a sale. I think it was just a notification that these would be going out of print. So I did grab these. So please let me know if you have any of these items in your collection and what you think about them. Um, also, let me know what you think about some of these older horror movies that are in black and white. Um, like I said, I really do like the artwork. And I really do enjoy reading your opinions and your um, comments about these um, releases. 
If you like what you saw here today, please give it a thumbs up and share the video. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, I'd really appreciate it if you subscribe. If you do um, subscribe, please remember to hit that notification bell so that you can be notified every time I upload a new video. If you haven't found me on my social media accounts, I'm on Facebook, Twitter, and on Instagram. And if you'd like to check out what I've been watching, you can find me over on Letterboxd. I do have links below. But thanks again for watching, and we will see you next time.